tragic start to the Labor Day weekend. An 11 year old girl going missing in the Kern River. 23 ABC's Ken Vicente is live for us in the Kern River Valley with the very latest on this search tonight. Ken. Yeah, good evening, Jackie and Brandon here at Keysville North. This is the site where that 11 year old girl and her grandfather actually went into the river. It's a little bit off to my left. We're going to take a look at it right now. This is the Keysville North campsite area. Search and rescue has been out here since about one o'clock when they received a call that two people were in the river, that being that 11 year old girl that is still missing and her grandfather. Uh, we spoke with Sergeant Steve Williams with search and rescue just a few minutes ago. He said that they were playing on one of the little rock islands out in the middle of the river. They did not have life uh, uh, vests or and it is unclear if they even knew how to swim when they were out there. Says that the girl went into the water and then that's when the grandfather tried to go in after her. They were able to rescue the grandfather about 200 to 300 yards down the river when they responded to that call a little after one. The search and rescue crews have still been in the water since then searching for that 11 year old girl. They have about a mile and a half radius is what Sergeant Williams was saying when they're searching for people that are missing right when they respond to that call that mile and a half radius from Keysville North Keysville South and other parts of the river is what they have been searching for that little girl and he basically said this was their worst fear uh, personified right now. They had worried when we spoke to them earlier today that they were bringing more crews up here to wait in the Kern River Valley because they were concerned about Labor Day weekend being uh, having these types of things happen with missing people, especially with how the summer has gone so far. So again, that 11 year old girl is still missing. Crews are now about to get out of the water, rehydrate because it is very hot. Sergeant Williams said get some dinner and then decide on their next point of action in this service. Again, they've searched about a mile and a half of this area searching for her. They will continue to search, he says, but in terms of how many boats they put in the water, that is still up for discussion. Live from Keysville North, Ken Mason.